Hello data managers, welcome to the first activity in unit 6, probability. So this first page asks you a question related to Monopoly. I imagine most of you have played Monopoly by this point in your lives. If not, uh, I strongly recommend it. It's a really fun board game. Anyway, um, there is this thing called jail in Monopoly, and if you land on jail, you can't get out unless one of three things happens. You roll doubles on a pair of dice, or you draw a get out of jail free card, or you pay $50 if you fail to roll doubles three times. So now the question that props up here is, what do you think are the chances of each of these events happening? So, 6.1, first out of four content items. This is our get out of jail free question. So we have those three po three possibilities. We can roll a double, we can get out of jail, we can get a get out of jail free card, or we can pay $50. But only one of those events is going to get us out in any single game. Now, we have this gentleman called Chad, and he decides to play Monopoly for a month and track what happens to him when he lands in jail. So, here we've got it. He lands in jail 200 times. He gets out with doubles on his dice 65 times. He gets out a, a jail out of free card. He gets a get out of jail free card 8 times out of 200. And then he pays $50 the remaining 127 times. Now, what is Chad's probability of getting out of jail if he rolls doubles and if he gets a get out of jail free card? This is an important question to ask because it's costing him $50 each time he doesn't get one of those. So, what is his probability of getting out of jail? Well, if he throws doubles, that's two numbers the same on two dice, that happens 65 times in 200. 65 over 200 is 32.5%. So that means 32.5% of the time, or roughly a third of the time, he gets out of jail with doubles. If he gets a get out of jail free card, he gets out 8 times out of 200, or about 4% of the time. So that is 1 in 25 times he gets out of jail with a get out of jail free card. And then the remaining 63.5%, uh, he pays $50. So that's 127 out of 200 times. In case you're wondering, that's not 50 real dollars, that is 50 Monopoly dollars. Or if you happen to be playing a Monopoly game from a different country or currency, chances are you'll be playing with another currency. I remember playing with thousands of dollars, or thousands of whatever it was, perhaps it was Gilders. So, we got this cute little card. This is from the original game. 